So listen, um, this isn't something that I wanted to share, but I'm on drugs. There we go. Open link. I believe in you, you believe in yourself. I'm working out. Don't set yourself up for disappointment. I could probably get you guys started with over 250k. Four in the morning is sort of like my, my sweet spot. So these are the two books. Again, 360 cameras. No, no, you cannot give that up. Dreams will come true. And if something happens, then it's a bonus. I'll sleep when I'm dead, right? Hey Uberheads, what's up? I'm sorry if you guys see all the mess. Wait a second, you cannot see the mess. And the reason you can't is because of this one, one angle. Next week, you will. You'll be able to rotate as I'm speaking and see the full 360 degree view and why you ask and how will I do this? We're getting 360 cameras from a company called 360fly.com. I can't wait to try them out. The one problem that we will have is audio and battery life. We're gonna test it out uh, in our Uber driving. I'm definitely gonna use these for behind the scenes. I am on my way right now to a meeting. That's why I look a little more spiffy. I am meeting up with a gentleman that I met on Uber. Uh, and this is what I'm saying. It's all about laws of attraction, people. It's all about taking on opportunities. You don't wanna be excited when you go in to meetings simply because it can go and work against you. If it doesn't work out, then you're gonna feel like it's a bummer and you're gonna be disappointed in yourself. I'm still disappointed anytime that I go in any meeting or anything that I do that could be beneficial to my success and I don't get it. If you're just starting out, the tip is don't set yourself up for disappointment and if something happens, then it's a bonus. That's not a pessimistic view by any means. That's just an ideal way to approach a situation and a meeting without you feeling down, regardless of what the outcome is going to be. And that's actually why people quit. A lot of people quit because they're disappointed. You need to change the way you approach disappointment. Uh, what else is going on? Uh, we just released uh, the ad I was up late again editing. It seems that four in the morning is sort of like my, my sweet spot. And I published Ed Robertson's episode. Sorry, what did you say musician? You did that for a living? Yep. You know, I wrote the theme song to the Big Bang Theory. Like, are you in a band? You... Yes, I'm in a band. Okay. And we're called Bare Naked Ladies. Oh my God. Uh, so Ed Robertson is the frontman for Bare Naked Ladies. It's been one week since you looked at me. And I picked him up just like anybody else driving Uber. I'm also bringing two of my books. So these are the two books that uh, my company, Mad Artist Publishing, has published. You've probably seen Jason Seiler's The Complete Artist book. This will change your life. For entrepreneurs, people who want to be motivated and inspired, but just don't know how to get started. Hello everyone, I'm Jason Seiler. It's uh, beyond what I was expecting. I mean, it's it's amazing. I'm really, 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 really happy with it. So that's a big coffee table book. So these are some of the other collectives that we have released. Everybody keeps saying the same thing over and over again. And that one thing is, whoa, nice Porsche, nice Porsche. Uh, and that one thing is to persevere and just keep at it because it's not about quitting it's about persevering and staying on point on point and getting to the finish line because you got to imagine all of the hard work that you have invested into this something into this project you've been living and thinking about 24 7 and you give that up no 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 you cannot give that up here's another example of the book robin so here's some of the artists i actually scored uh, a partnership with movie clips 
Robinclips.com right there. So we can link up QR codes of Robin Clips in the pages of the book. Because we're just gonna scan it. There we go. Open link. So is about saying something from your heart. Something personal, okay? Anyways, I am here at the meeting, so I have eight minutes to spare. Let's just show up and be early on. What's up, you guys? So I'm just leaving the meeting right now, but about an hour or so. I don't know where my keys are. Oh, it seems like I'm so far behind, yet I'm so far ahead. So these are the notes that I've got on the things that I need to do by Sunday. It's gonna be no sleep once again, which is fine. I'll sleep when I'm dead, right? Hello, Martian speaking. How can I help you? Hi there. Sorry, what was, what was the question you cut out? Why would I invest your 50000 of my company money into your business? The income is based on the trajectory of the sponsorship and advertising. I could probably get you guys started with over 250 k You got to go after the big companies that like to sponsor and splash everywhere. People are seeing that they want to be involved. They do. And I'm in this every day right now, right? I know. I know. I, know. I, know. I hear what you're saying. What if it fails? It then the sponsors come to you and they want to be part of something that's going to be a startup and that's going to be big. They're proud of the fact that they contribute to these two young guys in Toronto who've got the terrific idea and they can do this. Today was really interesting. Again, you guys saw how down I felt after I was up. I had two additional phone calls thereafter with um, um, two, two more people and they all gave me different points of view on how I should proceed. I, I did get a lot of really valuable input from my meeting today. Things that I kind of knew and wanted to try. I didn't want to go and invest more time and energy and money if it wasn't going to work out. And because I've never done anything like this, I wasn't sure. I guess at the end of the day, when you have four people who are highly successful and they take the time to give you their time and offer suggestions and feedback it's worthwhile investigating and uh, pursuing I am making progress because last year I didn't know any of these people anyway so thanks a lot guys for watching paying attention stay positive you can do it I know you can I know a lot of people say that but I truly believe it because I work with a lot of people on a daily basis who I see grow above and beyond of what they thought they, they could. I believe in you, you believe in yourself, and dreams will come true. So it's like almost midnight, and I am putting on my shoes, putting on my shoes. I'm heading off to see my girlfriend in another city. Do you guys always pack as heavy as I do when you go somewhere? Bag with crap, laptop bag, backpack. If you don't live in the city of Toronto, which is the metro, you pretty much have to have a car. If you don't have a car, you're pretty much screwed. I got a really nice t-shirt here. What do you guys think? I even forget that I'm wearing it and people are like, yeah, you look like it. You look like one. Can't wait to get the 360 camera so I can just hold this and you guys can see everything around me. I look like a lost weight because I'm wearing pants. Taylor pants. What are they sitting too low or they too long? So why don't you hem my pants? Like a good girlfriend. I have a sewing machine for that. You don't need a sewing machine, you need hands. I'm just about to get ready to go to the gym. Um, this isn't something that I wanted to share, but might as well know. I'm on drugs. So I just need a little pump pump with the um, pre-workout. What's it like to have a conversation with a bear? Hey man. What the hell are you doing over there? How's your week been? Dude, I think you're bleeding us dry. I actually get quite a lot of compliments. Exactly, and I'm not, I'm not going out and buying designer shit. You look like one. I was just talking just now until you interrupted me. It'd be creepy right now if you actually turned to look at the camera. <laughs> That'd be so messed up. There are no chicks with dicks, the only guys with tits. You look like a Kardashian. So I just want to say good luck you guys today, tomorrow, and the rest of the week. If you like the vlog, please subscribe, please like, share, and more importantly, watch the Uber Experiment videos because that is where the nuggets of wisdom 
R. So if you have to go back and see a 10 year old version of yourself, what would you tell yourself? <laughs> Don't get into this business though. Really? No. To anybody who's watching, it's very important that you need to team up with people who have better strengths and oh, skills than you do. Believe to achieve, because if you want it, you can get it. But with a trainer like you, I can't go wrong. Well, that's what I'm not a miracle worker, right? <laughs> oh! But don't worry about the people who are talking behind your back. They're behind no. you for a reason. And we went to the Playboy Mansion, and you have to was there. Do you think you're a good judge of talent? Can yeah. you spot it? Oh, absolutely. Ron Jeremy was there, <laughs> who I met. Kid Rock was there, who I met. Wee Man. I you have, you don't have a title? No, books? I'm writing it. I just, I've got a, a short list of titles. Like Meetup.com. Uh, it's a website that facilitates... Sounds like a dating site to me. It does, actually. doesn't it? But it's actually not. <laughs> I would go on my Facebook thing, which is Ron Hutchison. Uh, I mean, the, the way the world is today, what do you think kids should do to, I guess, better themselves? I mean, shoot for the moon, but you may end up way up there beyond the moon and into the stars. Yeah, that's pretty nice. I love it. my breath for a second there. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty crazy. Right on. Yeah, it's pretty nice. I love it. Who's taking a picture? <laughs> yeah. It's just recording. It's recording. It's recording. It's recording. It's weird. Yeah, he'll stop it. Everybody say one billion. <laughs> we Everybody say time? money. Yeah, I, that I, works. Could, I could tell you though, I've taken a group this small and changed it into convention centers of 15, 20,000. Wow. Yep. Right? I can do that with this group. Uh, you know, it's not how you get involved in the industry, it's who you get involved with. That's pretty crazy. <laughs> right on. Yeah, it's pretty nice. I love it. <laughs>